The Houthi rebels attacking trading vessels in the Red Sea have finally been attacked under a joint operation of U.S. and Britain Royal Air Force, and there are speculations that F-22 Raptor was used in making the attack successful. This fifth-generation fighter is the combo of stealth capabilities, advanced avionics and supersonic speed that have enabled it to establish air supremacy and defend the nation against the threats. F-22 is made by Lockheed Martin to become the pinnacle of modern combat, and it can take on Russian Su-35s and Chinese Chengdu J-10s from a distance of 150 kilometers without breaking a sweat. Join us as we dive into this sky marvel to see if it deserves its title of Sky's King or not. The first fifth-generation fighter plane in the world, US F-22 Raptor, will celebrate its 27th birthday on September 7, 2024. Developed as a result of a six-year development project to replace the aging F-15 Eagle Fighter, the F-22 Raptor had a truly ridiculous development cost of $66.7 billion. The serial production of this formidable aircraft began in 1997 and concluded in 2011. During this period, 187 serial airplanes and a total of 195 units, including pre-production machines, were manufactured. So, what did the military get for this significant investment? The answer lies in the F-22 Raptor's groundbreaking technology, particularly its radar and visibility, which is measured in EPR, also known as effective scattering area. With an EPR of 0.1 square meters, the F-22 Raptor presents an incredibly small radar profile. This makes it exceptionally difficult for enemy radar systems to detect. This feat is achieved through a combination of advanced technologies. Firstly, the aircraft's construction heavily incorporates composite materials based on bezimedes. It's a class of heat-resistant polymers capable of operating at temperatures up to 230 degrees Celsius. These materials, accounting for 40% of the aircraft's weight, are virtually invisible to the radar. The aircraft's unique radio-absorbing coating, its unique design and flat surfaces, also reduces its radar signature. Moreover, its special nozzle construction increases its stealth capabilities by effectively dispersing radar waves and reducing infrared visibility. The F-22 Raptor's stealth goes beyond the radar and visibility. Its engines have special ceramic materials that absorb radio waves and become less detectable by enemy radar. The aircraft's nozzles feature movable upper and lower surfaces that lets them have a control of thrust vectoring and enhance its maneuverability. This combination of stealth and maneuverability gives the F-22 Raptor a significant tactical advantage over its competitors in aerial combat. The aircraft's radar system, ANAPG-77, has an active phased antenna array that gives it exceptional detection abilities. It can detect Russian aircrafts like the Sukhoi Su-35 from distances as long as 140 to 160 kilometers. And to your surprise, the Russian aircraft will only be able to detect this marvel at a distance of 40 to 50 kilometers. The interesting point is that the Russian pilot would only be able to detect the F-22 Raptor at a distance of 40 to 50 kilometers. This detection ability allows it to stay alert of the presence of threats before they could even sense its existence. Besides, marvelous detection ability, the F-22 Raptor is also armed with missiles that are capable of shooting targets up to 120 kilometers. This is extremely beneficial in air-to-air -air combat scenarios. In the history of military aviation, no aircraft has been able to get as much hype as the F-22 Raptor has got. It was purposely built over a principle, first look, first kill, for achieving air superiority for the U.S. Air Force, and it turned out as a milestone for the technological achievement in this field. It can intelligently detect and engage enemy aircrafts before they even guess that there is an enemy foreseeing them. The most remarkable feature of the F-22 is its twin turbojet engines that power it to a maximum speed of Mach 3.5 with non-afterburner supersonic speeds in M8 range through flight range perfection, for which this fighter has been famous. The F-119 PW-100, made by Pratt & Whitney, propel it to a top speed of 2,410 km per hour. While this figure might appear impressive to you when you hear it first, it stays behind in comparison with the Russian Su-35 fighter that has a speed of 2,778 km per hour. As far as armament is concerned, the F-22 carries some of the most technological weapons. It is equipped with six AM-120C air-to-air missiles that have a range of 120 km. It has two AM-9M Sidewinder short-range missiles that can reach up to 35 km. It can also carry JDAM GBU-39 and SDB-53B precision bombs in internal bays. It also has a 20mm M61A2 Vulcan cannon, which is capable of firing off 480 rounds. The survivability of F-22 is achieved due to its design against multiple threats, 
including 30 mm shells, which are the main ammunition used by Russian aircraft guns. This toughness makes it a powerful enemy in battlefields. Even with its unquestionable power, the F-22's tail is also a story of restriction and controversy. In 1999, U.S. Congress passed a law which restricted its export to any foreign power despite the interest from Japan, Australia, and Israel. This limitation has led to the low production of the aircraft since only 195 units were produced before the cessation of its manufacture in 2011. Several factors contributed to the decision to stop production. The F-22 has an operational cost that is way above other aircraft such as the F-15C and F-16C costs at $68,000 per flight hour. The maintenance of the F-22 is also intricate and expensive because of its unique coating and design. A second disadvantage is its combat radius of only 760 km and insufficient ground attack capabilities. Although it performs well in aerial engagements, its ground target effectiveness is less impressive. However, the F-22 has not been given up by the Pentagon in spite of these challenges. Its unique features and outstanding performance have made it an important tool in the U.S. Air Force inventory, and that's the reason Pentagon is not ready to give up on this technological marvel. In November 2021, the U.S. Air Force took a major step in modernizing its F-22 Raptor fleet and signed a $10.9 billion contract for an upgrade program from Lockheed Martin. This move was a clear declaration of the Pentagon's determination to preserve the distinctive traits of the F-22 that has conquered the world with its stealth features, intelligence, and advanced technology. The modernization program is aimed at prolonging the service life of F-22 until mid-century, and even into the 2060s, when it will be replaced by sixth-generation aircraft. The project will be performed in Fort Worth, Texas for 10 years, and the goal is to upgrade onboard equipment and software of aircraft. One of the main improvements that F-22 will have is the improvement in its ability to detect and track targets. It will get a new optical location system with helmet-mounted display will be installed on the to enhance situational awareness of pilots. Moreover, improved communication equipment will also be installed in the aircraft to enhance the controllability of F-22 units during missions. The modernization program is also directed towards the replacement of the outer coating of the F-22 Raptor with a more advanced one that is similar to the F-35. This new coating will increase its stealth capabilities and help it hide out from the enemies. It's not possible that an aircraft gets an upgrade and its arms are not updated. The F-22 will get new advanced air-to-air -air missiles that would increase its effectiveness and make it lethal in combat scenarios. You might think that this will make the F-22 a limitations-free aircraft. But there are still some drawbacks in this fighter that might be covered up by some other fighter designed to be its competitor. The new Raptor will be missing the infrared search and tracking sensors that are important for detecting and tracking targets in passive mode without emitting signals that could let other aircrafts detect its position. These limitations can raise concerns about the ability of F-22 to counter advanced threats like Su-35. The modernization program also includes the integration of new air-to-surface missiles, including the AGM-158 JASSM, to enhance the F-22's capabilities related to ground attack missions. The heroic pilots will also get helmets equipped with joint helmet-mounted queuing system technology. This will allow them to receive targeting information and issue commands to air-to-air -air missiles without giving any manual input. They would simply turn their heads towards the target, and the missile would shoot the enemies down. It has been reported that the F-22 Raptor was used in the Yemeni Civil War. However, official confirmation is lacking, but this conflict has not been so combatic that it could pose a threat to F-22 Raptor. This is so because the Houthis rebels don't have a significant way in Yemen to attack the F-22 and get into its air defense systems. Recently, reports have said that the F-22 was a part of a joint USA and Royal Air Force operation to save the trading ships in the Red Sea. These kinds of reports were also observed in 2016 when they carried out an airstrike on the Houthi targets in Sana'a. However, there is no evidence that supports this assertion. Though the involvement of F-22 in Yemen remains officially unconfirmed, but speculations say that it might have played a role in it due to its amazing reconnaissance and electronic warfare capabilities. However, the U.S. military has not disclosed any details to substantiate these claims. What are your thoughts on it? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and watch the next video as well. See you again.